Hello and welcome to my channel, Reveal and Review, where today I am going to try Nitro Pepsi, the Nitro Vanilla Pepsi. Now here's a look at the can and get a little thumbnail action for you. All right, enough of that. Now this is new. It just came out uh, a couple of days ago. And uh, check back for my channel. I do have the regular Nitro Pepsi, which should already be up by the time you're seeing this one. Uh, so you'll have to watch that video to see what I thought of that, uh, the regular Nitro Pepsi. So we're going to give the uh, Vanilla Draft Cola Nitro Pepsi a go here in this video. So I guess... Uh, this is supposed to be like uh, infused with nitro. It says nitrogen infused cola, smaller bubbles, uh, smoother taste. And this is a 13.65 ounce can as opposed to the regular 12 ounce can. That's just what I found it in. I uh, found this in the uh, cooler uh, up by the front as I was checking out at the grocery store. And... It says uh, there's directions on this one to tell you how to drink the Pepsi. Uh, number one, chill can. Number two, pour hard. Number three, admire and enjoy. And we shall do all three of those things. I've already chilled the can, so that's one for three. And I have a glass over here off camera that we'll pour some in and uh, see if it looks any different. And then uh, it's supposed to have, like it says, smaller bubbles, which should give it a smoother taste. Uh, I don't know. Um, so we sh shall see. Like I said, this is a 13.65 ounce can. Uh, a little bit of nutritional information. There's 230 calories in one can. And uh, what are the sugars? 63 grams. I think that's about as much sugar as like what's in a Mountain Dew, maybe, if I'm not mistaken. So not really. This is the vanilla draft cola, vanilla version of the Nitro Pepsi. So let's open it up, give it a smell, give it a taste, and then I will give you a review. And that shall be that, as the kids would say. So, here we go. Wow. That was kind of cool. Can't waste it. Good taste in foam, anyway. All right, so let's give it a smell. Can't smell anything, actually. Just smells like a little bit of fizz. So let's pour it in here and see what this nitro stuff looks like. Uh, I can see, you can see bubbles in there and just a little bit of foam. Not a whole lot of foam. As you can see, gosh, and it, it dissipated, the foam dissipated right away. So, again with the smell, just smells like regular Pepsi to me. I don't even smell any vanilla. Uh, when I did suck the foam off the top of the can, I could taste a lot of vanilla. There was a pretty strong vanilla taste in there. So... <clears throat> Let's uh, give it a drink here, and we'll see what it tastes like. All right. Um, one more drink. A little bit of a burp there. Sorry about that. That's that nitrogen talking, I guess. So, here are my thoughts on it. It uh, There's a slight vanilla taste to it. Slight vanilla taste. But mostly what it tastes like is flat pop. And you can see that. I mean, it's less than, you know, a minute since I poured that into the glass. The foam is gone. I mean, I drank it, I guess, but I mean... The foam is gone. You can see small little bubbles in there, but it just tastes like flat pop to me. And the flatness of it, the flat taste of it, drowns out the vanilla taste. So all I'm tasting is flat pop with a flat Pepsi 
with a slight vanilla taste to it. The flatness drowns out the taste of the vanilla. So if you were wanting something really, really different, I mean, yeah, I'm going to have to say don't waste your money on this one. It just tastes like flat pop to me. Now, I do prefer, like, whether I'm drinking pop out of a can or whatever else I'm drinking, I prefer to drink it right out of the can. So let me give it a drink out of the can and see if it tastes any better that way. No, tastes exactly the same. Tastes like flat pop. Uh, about the best thing I can say about it is it made a cool noise when I opened the can. So that's good. So being that uh, it tastes flat, there's not a whole lot of vanilla. This is the vanilla Pepsi. And you would expect like a big vanilla taste to it, or at least I would. And the flatness of it drowns out the vanilla taste. So, gosh, I'm going to have to go. It's just not as advertised for me. I mean, I don't know what that nitro, not the nitrogen was supposed to do, but whatever it was supposed to do, I don't think it did it. So, I'm going to go with a... Given the fact that there's not that much vanilla taste, out of 10, I'm going to give it a 2 out of 10. It's rough. It, it tastes like flat pop. In fact, the other night... I, I'll tell you this, I, I, was, I always go downstairs and I'm working on the computer doing different things and I'll have like a Pepsi sitting there on my desk and the other night I got distracted uh, and got up and, and uh, forgot to take my Pepsi back upstairs and then when I went back down there the next night there was like a half a can of Pepsi there and I was like, well, I'm not going to waste that. I'll just drink it. I don't care if it's warm or flat or whatever it is and the flat regular Pepsi tasted better than that Pepsi straight out of the can. I'll tell you that. So that's my story. Two out of ten. That's my review. Hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, I'd like to uh, invite you to stop by my channel. There's lots of other uh, food reviews, lots of other drink reviews. Like I say, by the time you see this one, I will have the review of the regular uh, Nitro Pepsi up. So stop by my channel, check that out. There's lots of pizza reviews. Uh, I have a, a, a playlist of merchandise from YouTubers and bands that I like uh, and merchandise unboxings. So check that out. You might find that kind of interesting. And uh, so stop by my channel. I'm sure you'll find something to watch that will entertain you. I'd like to uh, invite you to share this video around, like, comment, and uh, subscribe if you feel the need, if you haven't already. And I'd like to thank you for watching this video, and I will catch you on the next one. Everyone have a good night.